advances in medical knowledge and technology now produce amazing outcomes for critically ill children, allowing them to survive severe illnesses that might have been fatal decades ago. But survival doesn't tell the whole story. Some challenges may persist after children are discharged from the ICU. As children leave the pediatric intensive care unit, PICU, and continue to recover, parents may notice some changes compared to before they became ill. Some kids may need new equipment and technologies to help them continue to recover. Some may need closer follow-up care after they leave the hospital. William was six months old when he was hospitalized because he was severely dehydrated due to vomiting and diarrhea. William also experienced a seizure when he came into the hospital. He improved after a few days in the PICU, was transferred to the general pediatric floor, and then was able to go home. His parents were worried about whether he would get sick again. They also had to rearrange their work schedules to make follow-up appointments with William's pediatrician and the neurologist. Maya was four years old when she developed sepsis after a stem cell transplant due to neuroblastoma. She needed antibiotics for several weeks. She required mechanical ventilation for over a month and required a tracheostomy, ventilator, and gastrostomy tube. Her sisters could not visit her while she was in the hospital because of hospital policy during flu season. Maya was transferred to a chronic care facility while waiting for home nursing to be arranged. Maya's mother was worried about how many hours of nursing care she would receive and whether she would be able to continue working once Maya came home. Over the next six months, Maya got stronger and was able to have her tracheostomy and gastrostomy tube removed. Life at home started to feel more like it did before Maya was in the PICU. Stories like Williams and Maya's tell us there is always something more to healing after getting out of the hospital. Some problems might persist and require ongoing care even after discharge home. If you're worried about your child and wondering if they'll get back to normal, you're not alone. There are things that can help.